My name is Greta Bell, my studio number is 21, and I am an oil painter. Oh, I paint, I think, uh, I really, I paint like four, four types I just keep s circling around, which would be architecture, uh, people's, people's faces, um, random objects, and animals. I don't know, I'm just, I'm very drawn to them, and I'm equally drawn to them, so I'll make a building, an animal, an object, but I think my favorite are objects, random objects, which, uh, I don't know, I just see something and I'm just, oh, I have to paint that fire hydrant. I just, I just can't help it. Or, or a lot of times it's something that is uh, meaningful to someone, or it's someone I really love and I just pick one of their things and I just paint it. And for architecture, I think it, that's because I, um, well, I grew up in my home, my mother collected a lot of art, and uh, she would also work with artists and they would paint their building, their, ho their homes. And so we have many different types of artwork that became, were our homes. So my mom has like little wooden houses that was the home I grew up in, and it's just a uh, beautiful oil painting, watercolor. And so I just feel like that's such a treasure because we've moved, but we still get to see these structures. So it's a, um, it's like a, a, a heart, a cord to that, and but we can transport it. We can't bring your homes with you. So, so I feel like I like to. If I see a beautiful home, I just like to paint it. <laughs> the revolving circus. Well, right now it's in a big transition. I want to be in places where people aren't expecting art, and they're just going to be forced to look at it. So I, I um, worked with Jim Jenkins, another artist here, and uh, he built me um, a mechanical collapsible carousel and um, and so and I did I brought it with me all the way across the country and set it up but it it's very large and it's it, it's 12 feet tall so it, now it's in a transition where it's going to be smaller and we're gonna make it so that I can be biking and a trailer behind it and then set it up and then I'll take the bike off I'll attach it to it and then I'll ride my bike and it'll swirl and I'll make it smaller so that I can do that and make smaller paintings. So I'm, I'm selling all my old paintings to, to, um, to pay for that. They were objects that were special to people. Um, um, let me think about them. There's a swing, which, and each, each object, I had someone write up a, a, a one to four sentences of why it was important to them. Some people wrote poems um, uh, or like little life stories, and they were really fabulous and fun. Um, so I have like a sewing machine, a swing, a carousel horse, and the people range in age from three to probably 70. But I could do someone that's 100. <laughs> uh, but they're just um, special objects. Uh, and then it's gonna continue on that way where I'll pop it up in random places on the bike trail in Chicago, wherever I go. And um, I hand out postcards and then ask for people to send me a special object and a story about it. I'll then paint it and then put it on, and this uh, Our Evolving Circus, which is really what it's called, it will um, encompass everywhere I've gone and people I've met and their stories, and then it'll just keep changing and evolving over time. I, I gather colors together, and I make a, a small um, key and I keep all my keys and all my photographs and I um, so each painting has different keys that are colors that I like for that moment and I can use the same key for another um, painting but it won't it won't look at all the same because colors are magical.